Welcome to Watch Card Security Byte, I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is the Facebook outage was not a hack. You all probably know this by now, but yesterday, which was March the 13th, Facebook had its longest outage ever. And besides Facebook, WhatsApp, Instagram, and even one of my favorite companies, Oculus, had some related outages as well because they're all Facebook properties. In any case, during this time, Facebook seemed to be down anywhere from 2.5 to even 7 hours, depending on where you were and, and how you were affected. But it was the longest outage they've ever suffered that I can remember. Now, if you're like our threat team here at WatchGuard, a lot of us were curious whether or not this could have been a DDoS attack or some other sort of uh, cyber attack. For instance, maybe some sort of BGP attack like uh, accidental and purposeful ones we've seen before. As it turns out, that's not the case. Today, which is Thursday, Facebook did update and they basically say it was just a server configuration configuration flaw, a flaw that actually had a cascading effect through their entire infrastructure, but it was just some sort of human mistake and server configuration flaw. Nonetheless, it was a big deal, and today a couple of their executives have left the company, although maybe not in all cases related to this outage. In any case, this just adds more insult to injury with Facebook's bad year when it comes to election hacking, criminal prosecutions having to do with them sharing data with other companies, and just many other things. Now, I don't have any sort of big practical takeaway here other than just telling you this does not seem to be a cyber attack, so you don't have to worry about that. However, I do think it's a good example of how a basic you know, network-based configuration issue can have a big effect. And this is why vulnerabilities in things like the, the BGP protocol, or more specifically, not vulnerabilities, just lack of secure validation in the BGP protocol could also lead to pretty huge ramifications. Uh, again, that was not the case in this particular incident, but it just goes to show how, how much we rely on network connectivity to gain access to a lot of our web services. Anyways, interesting story. It wasn't a hack, but it was the biggest Facebook outage ever. That's it for today's video. Thanks for watching.